So, we are from the Dorian Society, uh, Dimapur, and we have called this press conference uh, to speak about the first spell B competition in Dimapur district organized by Dorian Society. And we are thankful to all of you for coming to this press conference. I will just give a brief about our society. Dorian Society was formed in the year 1997. And as per our history, it was the initiative of young enthusiasts who were uh, willing to see transformation take place within their society. And uh, they came together and they started uh, this society. Uh, the motto of our society is uh, German Court, which is only hast, only rust, without haste, without rest. And from the initial years, uh, the, the members of the society worked tirelessly to, to fulfill these objectives of uh, uh, developing the society and also bringing transformation in the community. And uh, so far, you know, uh, even though we started uh, with sports as our main uh, uh, program, project, over the years, as the society evolved, we started, you know, involving in social activities. We also organized events, uh, many events, you know, in these you know, few years. And, uh, and uh, we also kept on, you know, uh, organizing the sports events uh, till uh, date. And so uh, that is what uh, we have done thus far. Uh, over the years, uh, according to my memory, I believe we started uh, organizing basketball tournaments and we even had uh, teams from other states come and, uh, you know, play participate in our in our tournaments then uh, then we also collaborated with other like-minded organizations to organize the naga idol uh, a few years back then uh, we also did a community uh, lighting project in Uttan Basti then we had the dustbin you know project because there was a lot of problem you know with uh, you know how to uh, throw the garbage and so we came up with this project and this really helped you know the families in and around you know this Luton Basti area. Uh, then uh, we also uh, did a lot of relief uh, projects you know when uh, we had uh, flat, flash, uh, floods uh, during COVID time you know we worked alongside uh, the government as well as other social organizations, you know, to help those who are in need. Um, we also uh, uh, involved in uh, tree plantation during the uh, World Environment Day because uh, climate is also our concern. And so, as I have said, over the years, our society has evolved and we have started, you know, inculcating uh, new ideas, new thoughts and we are uh, trying to move forward. This year, we are going to celebrate uh, the Silver Jubilee, 25 years of our existence. And uh, many of our projects since 2019 is in commemoration commemor of uh, our Silver Jubilee. And so we have done fitness work, we have organized cyclotron event, and uh, you know, this year we are going to start with this Spell B competition. And so uh, our friends will share a bit about uh, the first. This is the first spelling bee competition going to organize by Torian Society for sc school children from grade seven to nine, from grade seven to nine, with an in innovative approach that combines <coughs> competition, uh, that combines learning with fun and competition, right? And participants, participants, uh, two students from grade. Any from grade seven to nine, any two students, the school can choose and send it to like you no know, for participation from each school, 
and uh, we also encourage common schools to take more part on this competition we also know and now my my friend MT will say more about it again well I, I want to add that the event will be held on 25th of June that is second Saturday no fourth Saturday Oh, fourth Saturday, sorry, at DBIDL building, Dombosco campus. Mm. So that's one information, and then uh, we would like the. We have almost gone to around 30 plus schools, distributed forms, and we have told them to let us know their confirmation by 31st of May. So we are expecting lots of schools to take part mm. and then I'd also like them to let us know by 31st May so that we can arrange everything in a positive manner. Okay, please, I don't know. Uh, initially the date was supposed to be on 11th of June but since NBAC came up with a circular yesterday saying midterm exams will be conducted from 8th to 18th of June, so we have postponed the date to 25th June. So to all the schools uh, which we have distributed the forms, we would like to mm -hmm. let them know that it's been postponed to 25th of June. And again, uh, I just want to add some more points. We have already uh, distributed study materials, like containing 500, uh, 500 words for the students to study. Yeah, and again, the registration fee for each student will be 200. For each, and again, while coming for the uh, competition, uh, we would like the school authority to send one of the coordinator or the or this, uh, teacher along with the student. And the students are supposed to come with, um, they are asked to come uh, with uh, their school identity card. Yeah? And with mm. their complete school with uniform. With their complete school uniform, yeah. So, till now, that's, that's it. Mm. Okay, and kindly, we would like to request you, request you guys that uh, if you can add up our phone number, in the press release or anything like that, that so that school authority can give us yeah, a call and get in touch with us. Yeah. yeah. There was no, uh, we couldn't uh, cover up all the we'll schools. We'll give you. So other schools couldn't cover up. Yeah. They can contact this number yeah. and we'll tell them the process and all. Okay, the contact numbers are 700-577-5500. That's Mr. MT, convener. And the other one is 8974-037-334. That's Narupongan. Mm. Just to, to reach the venue by latest by 9 o'clock. Because the program will start at 10 o'clock. Uh, Active participation from government schools. That's why we're not taking any registration fee from them. On behalf of uh, Doyen Society and also on behalf of uh, the organizing committee of the first Spelby competition, we want to appeal to all the schools to take active participation you know, in this competition. I know uh, if you send uh, uh, students, they will enjoy you know, being a part of this uh, competition. And so we say 30 schools, but you know, we know that there are more than 200 schools uh, in this district. And so we want you know, more schools to come and uh, participate in this competition. As we have mentioned uh, earlier, we want uh, government schools also to participate. And so I think uh, the leaders of the government schools should take note of that and send their students you know, for this competition. I think thank you so much from all uh, of us. Yeah. I have a question. Yeah. Uh, you mentioned only the students per school, right? Yes. Yeah. So why is there a bar for that? Like, if, if at all some school wants to have uh, 
uh, give like five students for their participation. So would, would that be a possibility? As in more than two students, if the school is willing to have, if the school is willing to send or no, as per the decision of the committee, uh, we have made uh, you know two two participants from each school because we also uh, felt that you know there are a lot of schools you know in in uh, Dimapur and we also uh, thought about the the venue whether the venue can accommodate you know this much students but I think uh, we will see later on if we can accommodate you know some more students from uh, a school and also in regards to the jurisdiction of the Mapur district yeah. this is funny to say but then we have only till uh, Fort Mali if I'm not mistaken the jurisdiction of the Mapur yes yes so now whatever you were talking about you know, Dima, <laughs> no no yes when we say Dimapur it includes the rest, uh, new land, Chubukinima, all the uh, three yeah. newly or, from district. from other districts. Yes, other districts. They can also take a note for now. For now. The SDOs in uh, new land district and Chubukinima hasn't been set up properly. They are still under SDO Dimapu, if I'm not mistaken. They have just... Uh, yeah, they, uh, just recently they have uh, integrated a building, but I don't know whether officers have been posted or not. Mm. So that's why First, while the Mapu district were including them also. So, if they want to take part, they are most welcome. Schools, okay. So, shall we just mention as uh, the participants can be from uh, the schools under the jurisdiction of the Mapu uh, district? DEO, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 That, will be, yes. that will be good. That will be good. And there's no limit for the number of schools to participate. No. There's no limit. There's no limit. No. 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 That's why we are making it two. But for example, if we have less, uh, you know, uh, participating schools, then maybe we can think of more, you know, participants from one school later on. Huh? <coughs> you mentioned that you have reached out to 30 plus schools. So yeah. Are you planning to visit more schools during this uh, coming? Yes, week? yes. We have we have more time. You know, since our program has been postponed, so we'll try to reach out to more schools. Yeah. Yeah, there is. Yes. Yeah. For private schools, registration fee is two hundred per student, but for government schools, it's free. Also, is there? Can you? Price money. The, the price, 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 price money. Oh, price, price money. Price money. Okay. Price money will be there. Price will yeah. Be there. yeah. First, first prize will be like five thousand with certificate, and second will be three thousand, and the third will be two thousand, and all the participants participants will be like. Given a. Certificate. Given a certificate. All the participants. So why exactly did your society uh, chose spelling the competition? Why exactly? Yeah. Yes. I mean, there's lots of No, yes. yeah. Yes. I think this was discussed, I think, many years back. And we were not able to, you know, organize this event. Uh, and so, since this is the Jubilee year, we thought that, you know, we can include uh, even the children, you know, in our dream, in our, in our objective. And so that's why, you know, we are organizing, you know, this uh, event, this competition. And uh, we have not discussed it in our, in our AGM yet, but hopefully this can be an annual event, yeah. you know, even for Dorian Society. Yeah. And so that is something that uh, will be discussed later, but uh, that is in the pipeline, yeah. Can you also tell us more about the number of rounds that you going to take place and how you attend the it's yeah. going. It's it. It will be more like a knockout round, yeah. Uh, and and we are we are still to work it out like that. We'll because wait for we'll the wait for the part, uh, number of participants yeah. and then.